So another easy tape design to do at home is the lightning bolt French tip, which I really love. And again, going with some 80s glam look. Like I said before, tape is an easy way to do nail art for people who aren't very confident with um, their painting skills or aren't very good at using their non-dominant hand. But doing a French tip is also a great way to fix a mani that's old. So if your mani's chipping, it's a week or so old, and you don't want to repaint the whole thing, you can slap some tape on your nail and paint a cool, fun design on the tip, and off you go. To do this one, you're going to want to cut it kind of at a diagonal like this. And you're gonna, I mean, keep in mind the, the width of your nail when you're cutting this. You don't want to make a huge lightning bolt and then it doesn't fit. That makes no sense. So we're gonna cut it at a bit of a diagonal here. Just a little one, because we're just doing the tip. Okay, so you have kind of like a little side, tri I don't know, triangle like that, I guess we call it a triangle. And then you want to take your scissors right at the crease right here. Go ahead and just cut all the way over, right? So then your tape looks like that, okay? So then you're going to lay it on your finger, nail, just like so. Remember to push all the way down, all the way to the edge, push really hard. Make sure it is sticking completely to your nail. You don't want any tape getting under that. Okay, then go ahead and just put this all on every nail. And again, if you don't like where it's sitting, just redo it. The joys of tape. This is a super punk look that I like to use when I'm feeling especially badass when I wake up in the morning. Take your paint. Just go ahead and cover it. Make sure you get right up into the paint and on the table. All right, and then once you have all the paint on your fingers, just go ahead and pull these off. And I like to pull them, well, you should pull them this way because if you pull them the other way, then the triangle tip is at the top. It won't come off properly. It'll just mess everything up. So go with the grain. Voila, you just put a top coat on there and you're good to go. A nice simple design and also an easy way to fix a chipped mani.